Should we head home now? I'm thinking I should check out this place a little bit more. Okay. I'll wait here then. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. Oops. I have to do what Chi Chi asked me to do first. Can't get sidetracked now. Should we head home now? All right, let's head home. Right. <laughs> Here goes. Flying Nimbus. All right, hang on tight. <laughs> Whoa! It's a dinosaur! Bye-bye! Flying Nimbus is super fast! I've been riding this whole thing since I was just a little kid! Only those with a pure heart can ride it. That explains why you've got no problems there. Yeah, this is fun. Man, I'm low on energy. Something tells me we're gonna be a little late. Sure hope Mom isn't too mad. <laughs> You're making me nervous, Gohan. I haven't been to Grandpa's place in a long time. I feel kind of bad.
Hey, Chi-Chi, we're back! And we've got food! Hi, Mom! You're late, Goku! It shouldn't have taken you so long to gather ingredients! Yeah, sorry about that. We did some training, too. You're supposed to introduce Gohan to Master Roshi and the others today! Wait, that's today? Of course! Ah, sorry about that. I promise I'll remember next time. Forget it. What are you waiting for? Get in here! I need to get cooking right away! Goku, where do you think you're going? I'm not done yet, so just sit tight! Right. Now then, I'll just take these ingredients and whip you up something tasty. This is the stone me and Krillin used in our training. Me and him had to hunt this thing down. Krillin beat me then, but only because he cheated. I had to go hungry that night. <laughs> to see Master Roshi, my old master. His place is surrounded by the sea. It's loads of fun. Oh, yeah. All right, I'm finished. Here are your lunches. Dig in whenever you're hungry. Thanks, Chi-Chi. Your stuff's the best. It really gets the blood pumping and the muscles moving. Right, Gohan? Yeah. Later, Chi-Chi. We're off to see Master Roshi. Wait a second. Are you forgetting something, Goku? I thought you had something for Gohan. Oh, yeah, that's right. Wow, what a neat little ball. That little ball on top there? It's a Dragon Ball. I got it from my grandpa after he died. But that's not all you got from him. You were also named after him. Really? Oh my, Gohan looks so handsome. It'll be like he's watching over you whenever you wear that hat. So take real good care of it, okay, Gohan? Yeah, I will. Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dad. All right, we're leaving for real this time. Goku, don't let anything happen to our little Gohan. And Gohan, be on your best behavior. I will, Mom. Bye! I want you both home by supper, you got it?
It's said there are seven mystical orbs capable of granting any wish when brought together. With them, anything the heart desires can be attained, whether unfathomable riches or absolute power. These mysterious wish-granting orbs are known as the Dragon Balls. And it's around these Dragon Balls that this extraordinary story unfolds, with new challenges and adventures awaiting Goku and his friends at every turn. Hey, Dad? What's Master Roshi like? Well, he looks like a feeble old geezer, but he's super strong. Really? Though, it's a real shame he's kind of a massive pervert. Yeah, he was my rival at the time, but now he's my best friend. Is Krillin strong, just like you? Yeah, seriously, out of all the guys I know, he's definitely up there. There's also a woman I know named Bulma. See, she was looking for the Dragon Balls when she ran into me, and we ended up going on adventures together. If we hadn't done that, I probably wouldn't have met Master Roshi and the others. I see. Goku! Yo! Oh, and who's this little guy? Meet my son. What? what? Your, your son? Yeah. Wild, huh? Nice to meet you. Oh, uh, n nice to meet you too. His name is Gohan. Gohan? Oh, so you named him after your grandpa, huh? Yeah. Suits him, don't you think? Goku, have you been training lately? Well, not as much as I want to. Chi-Chi gets pretty angry if I train too much, you know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, I haven't trained myself either. With Piccolo taken care of, things have been pretty quiet. Hey, you two, what are you talking about? Uh, 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 nothing really. Hmm, I could have sworn you two were talking about how you've both been slacking off on your training. <sighs> Guess there's no fooling you, is there, Master Roshi? It would seem you've both forgotten that training is a daily activity. Not something you do only on special occasions. You should be moving, learning, playing, eating, and resting every day. That's the way of the turtle school. I can't argue with you there. Now, to make sure you two never forget your daily training, I've got a little challenge for you. Come report back to me once you've finished your training. Yes, sir, Master Roshi. Yes, sir, Master Roshi. Now, time to get back to my usual enjoyment. Yes. Uh, um. Hey. <laughs> Greetings. Huh? 
たいなとこは。Greetings. Yeah. What should I do now? What? Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> yep. Greetings. Hey, looks like yep. What's this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, here we go.
your looks, but does he have your power, too? I'm betting that he's pretty strong, if I had to guess. But I can't be sure since Chi-Chi won't let me train him to find out one way or the other. No meteor. Just as I thought, the creatures on this planet are still alive. Kakarot's failed us. Uh, who or what are you? A power level of only five? What trash. Uh, stay back! Ah! Is this the best this planet can muster? Well, now, here's a large power reading. Distance 4880. Kakarot? Huh, what in the world could that have been? Never felt a power like this. Not sure what this is, but I better check it out. <laughs> <laughs> 